back in my Let's Platinum Dragon Age Origins. Uh, we are in Orzammar, we just uh, basically going through Orzammar, uh, visiting all the places that we need for Traveler Trophy for now. And in the tavern we met Ogren, so we'll try to talk to him again. Sod off, Duster. No, that's all. So maybe later on we can talk to him. I hope so. So uh, for now we're gonna go to Dust Town. Wow, 1,377 kills. Almost lit. Two hundred thirty one codex entries discovered. Wow. Oh dear. The differences between this side of town and the others is striking. Hmm. Okay, we have some places to visit. Time really for more well. practice. We'll get plenty for their kid once Whoa. we cut them out of it. Straight away they are yeah. 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 Yes. Who are you? You don't look like any guardsman I ever saw, and that's not much of a uniform. I am Hyde by a Grey Warden. Oh, you looking for a chance to bring in some coin? Could be I have that opportunity, especially for someone with a few connections above ground. I'd have to hear what you're asking. Human kings, you know. They make these ridiculous laws. Like about who gets to buy and sell Lyrium, the sacred gift the stone provides us to show her love. No law should regulate that. The laws are meant to keep mages away from the stuff, so there's always buyers in the Circle Tower. I got one man named Godwin. He's expecting a delivery of a stone's weight. You want an investment opportunity? Uh, I could see fit to, say, sell you that lyrium instead at the reasonable price of 50 sovereigns. You can keep it, or, since you can travel freely from here, sell it to Godwin, who you know is buying. And uh, if you bring back his return order, I could pay you, uh, say, 20 sovereigns as a finder's fee. Wow. Fifty's a bit much when you've got no options, Forty. You haggle like a merchant born. Deal. Right, here's the lyrium, then. You uh, probably don't want to take it out of the box. I'll be waiting for the next order somewhere out of sight. Say, just around the corner. Okay, we paid 40. I wonder how much we can earn here. What was that? Okay, Almar's Emporium. Um, Almar Emporium Market. Boom. Do you sell backpacks? What are you looking for? We got nothing to buy for the likes of you. Or maybe you wanted to sell. <laughs> of course. Let me see. Let me see what you got, bro. Crow dagger. 
even crossbow. Other skis recipe, what the hell is that? Freeze bomb. Oh, I have no money. Um. So I think we have two quests to circle now. That was uh, there was a girl that wanted to. There was a girl that wanted to join the circle, and now we have Illyrium to sell. Okay. Suspicious door. Look through the slot. Please, it's not for me, it's for my child. Suspicious door. I don't know, I have nothing about this here, so... I don't know if I need to visit it or not. Let's talk to this dude. Have you a coin to spare, lady? It's for my son. He's sick. He hasn't any clean clothes to wear or anything to eat today. Neither have I. Why, the, why doesn't your son's father help you? A question I ask every day. He was eager enough for a daughter who would bring him into the mining cast. But since the boy was born, I've not seen Nose or Heal of the Lout. And me alone on the street, forbidden to return to my family unless I... But no, I can't bear to even think of it. What does your family want you to do? My son's father is castless, as is he. I used to be a miner, but my parents stripped my caste and refused to accept me back. Unless I agree to abandon the child in the deep roads and pretend I never bore him. <laughs> wow. Maybe I could reason with your family. You would do that? But why? <laughs> uh... I don't like to see child suffer. Then I cannot offer enough gratitude. But I warn you, my father is a stiff-necked man. His name is Ordell, and he's usually at Tapster's in the evening. I do not think he will listen to you. But I will wait anxiously to see if you can do what you promise. Okay. Slams house. Uh, it's on the list. Okay, let's mark it. really here um, anything else here Jarvia's gangster hideout Pfft. it might be that uh, locked place I think yeah it seems like okay. 
and it has to be this. Okay. Maybe later. Let's talk to this dude. Your clothes are so fancy. Did you get them topside? <laughs> yes, I did. My ma'am used to say they don't got no stone to protect them topside. If I go up there, I'm gonna fall into the sky. <laughs> no, that doesn't happen. Yes. <laughs> when my doll left, he never came back. Who's to say he didn't fall up, eh? <laughs> don't fall into the sky when you go back up there. Um, I guess that's it for now here. Shady corridor. What do you want, Warden? You're out of your element down here. I'm looking for the thief who, who dared to steal from shop raid. Is that so? What makes you think anyone here would turn me, I mean, this person in? You've walked into a sodding fight, Warden. And I've already passed your stupid tome along. Too bad for you. Dude. How can you be that stupid? Damn. Okay. So we finished that quest. Well, look at that. It's not often old Nadezda sees a fine-dressed stranger here in Dust Town. Help a poor cripple. Hmm. Uh, why not? Here's five silvers. Buy yourself some food. You're as kind as you are beautiful. I owe you when I get back on my feet. If my feet still worked. Not many from your parts even bring coin down here, much less share it. You got a vice to fill? Old Nadezda can set you right up. Hmm. How did you get crippled? I'd say it was an accident to try to get some sympathy coin, but you look like you'd rather hear the truth. I was running protection for the Carta when some guardsmen caught me. Guster I was with had coin for a bribe, but I took a stand. Guardsmen broke my sodding kneecaps and had me kneel in dung until the infection set in. Never healed proper. Can they just get away with that? You think they shouldn't? You take them fancy clothes and tell the assembly attacking a castless should be a crime. You're born to wear a branded face in Orzammar, and you'll live your life in Dust Town. What do you mean by brand? Means you don't exist. It tells everyone who sees you not to work with you, not to serve you, and not to care if you're hurt. The Deep Lords burn it into us the day we're born, so no one accidentally oversteps her place. <laughs> Where's the body go to get drunk around here? <laughs> if you have that kind of coin, Salroka, you don't want to drink what they've got here. Take yourself up to Tapsters. As long as your face isn't branded, they've got anything you want. I'll just stay out of. Damn, I thought she would tell me something about this door. to comments so solve one quest we have nags two nags to give and uh, we just got a quest to get that guy uh, 
I think she said he's in dumpsters, right? Yeah. Forgot what his name is though. No, I don't need to remember. What are you looking at, stranger? I met your daughter. I have no daughter. Could be you met a castless whore claiming she was once mine. If you don't take Zerlinda back, she'll die. What? You think she'd die just to keep that thing? She knows what she has to do to come home. I never wanted her gone. Just a little cur. Can't she see she'd have a better life if she got rid of it? He's a baby, not a cur, and she loves him. Look, just tell her. We never meant to hurt her. It just seemed best that. Oh, just tell her to come home. Her mother and I are waiting for her. Alrighty. Sod off, Duster. Let's finish this quest quickly. <clears throat> Win. 21,530 damage. back. I thought you weren't coming. What did he say? Your father wants you both to come home. Both of us? I don't believe he said that. I've never heard him refer to my son as anything but trash. He calls him it. But maybe. Maybe mother convinced him. Or you did. Oh, my friend. I cannot thank you enough. If this were a story, my son would grow to manhood and pledge himself as a knight in your service. When he grows up, I will send him to you. I promise. Alrighty. Quest completed. No reward again. Does not even show this strange door. This dude, right? You're the best wrangler I've ever seen, but there's more out there. You're the best wrangler I've ever seen, but there's more out there. I trust Vala, my nug wrangling friend. There are really more out there. No, I cannot go there. I want to go here because we finished the the quest with the the thief.
Can you believe it? Algren's barely even warrior cast anymore, and he just clomps in here like he's entitled. <laughs> Who is Algren? Algren's a drunken wretch. He comes up here two, three times a week, hounding people to lead some suicidal rescue mission after Bronca. Gets quite violent about it. I'd be scared if they hadn't practically gelded him after he killed young Lord Mino. What do you mean, gelded him? Well, he killed Lord Mino's youngest son in a duel to first blood. It was a huge scandal. Ogren should have been executed, but he'd won honors in the deep roads. Instead, they stripped him of all weapons and forbid him from engaging in fights within city limits. If he breaks the decree, he'll be exiled. Why does Ogren care so much about Branka? <sighs> She's still his wife, isn't she? Even if she took their entire house into the deep roads and abandoned him. Branka was married to the drunk? Well, before she was a paragon, she was just a smith. And Ogren was one of the best warriors of his generation. Why did Branka go into deep roads? Chasing some old treasure. She was quite secretive. Outright rude, really. She said she never asked to found a house, that she didn't care about politics, and that we were too self-absorbed to defeat the Darkspawn. She actually threatened anyone who said they'd come after her. How did she become a paragon? She invented a smokeless fuel that let the Smith cast increase their output by nearly a third. Deaths from the Black Lung also dropped. The assembly said she had the favor of the ancestors and declared her a paragon. They moved Bronca, Ogren, and all their relatives to the noble caste and founded a new house in her name. What were you and Ogren arguing about? It's been two years since Bronca left. No one has ever stayed in the deep roads that long and survived. The search teams who went out found nothing but... Ogren wants to keep risking lives searching. Okay, we asked yeah, that already. She's still his wife, isn't she? Even if she took their entire house into the deep roads and Is that what you two him. were arguing about, Branca? It's been two years since Branca left. Hmm. The search teams who went out found nothing, but did you see any guardsmen tell him Ogren was at it again? Okay, so we find out a bit more about uh, why he's so... Questions arise regarding Lord Valen's impending marriage to a captious commoner. Favoritism... News of the hour. Two more clans endorse Lord Valen as the new king. Change mm -hmm. is inevitable. Is it here? No, it's assembly, right? You know. Wow. It's here. All the way back. But I think we already got a um, trophy for the side missions. Disgusting. Someone stole from the Shaper. The memories have never seen such a thing. Did you get a good look at him? I did. He was bald, with the most garish brand across his head. Almost like he took pride in being castless. Imagine! Ah, he's probably in the slum somewhere. As if he'd find a buyer for a stolen tome in Dust Town. They couldn't know the value. I just found him. Oh, the thief didn't have the stolen tome. Someone in the proving grounds. Hmm. All right. I 
I guess in this case, before we are going to <laughs> visit the proving, I'm gonna go to a circle of Magi. Yeah, I'm gonna make some money. The Lord I'm gonna finish two quests. And, and I, as well, I'm gonna. News of the hour. I'm gonna visit the, the party camp and uh, put some runes in my new dagger. My new awesome dagger. So when the fights will start, I will have no problems. I think now I can uh, I can travel di directly to Orzammar, right? Maybe not. Maybe not. I oh, know I can travel towards the more now. Okay, circle tower. Okay, who I had to talk with? Welcome back, friend. You'll be glad to learn that the circle is well on its way to recovery. Dagna of Orzammar wishes to study magic. Orzammar? Indeed. <laughs> you have piqued my curiosity. It is common knowledge that dwarves lack the aptitude for spellcraft. She will never be able to weave the simplest magic, no matter how hard she tries. Hmm. All she wants is to study the theory of magic. Fascinating. <laughs> I suppose the circle should be flattered. She's willing to give up case, uh, cast and clan for this. I see. If she is willing to sacrifice so much for this, then we should feel honored. Tell Dagna of Orzimar that this path will not be easy. But if she chooses it, then she is welcome here at the Circle. She will live and study with the Tranquil, and perhaps the apprentices when it is appropriate. Thank you, First Enchanter. Ah, if only the circle was in better shape. I fear she may be disappointed when she arrives. Perhaps, but it was her choice to make. 
This will be interesting. <laughs> she could tell us much about our dwarven neighbors. Yes, the more I think about it, the more I like the idea. I shall take this as an indication that perhaps things are starting to look up for the circle. <laughs> Thank you. Is there anything else I can do for you? You've already done much for the circle. Now you must see to your duty as a Grey Warden. I wish you well. No, you will always be welcome here. Okay, so we got this quest. Okay, and... Godwin. Where is Godwin? So, tell me, you have any children, grandchildren, I don't know, great-grandchildren? What would make you think I have any children at all? You have to know I've spent most of my life in the circle of Magi. You just seem like the grandmotherly type to me, I don't know. <laughs> I suppose I'll take that as a comment on my demeanor and not my age. Mages aren't forbidden to marry or anything, are they? It's not such an outlandish question. Isn't it? What sort of man would marry a mage, do you think? Well, how about another mage? There are just as many men as there are women within the circle, as I recall. Union is not encouraged, although that does not... Where the hell is Godwin? Seeking out other's company from time to time I all right suddenly you don't seem quite so grandmotherly to me anymore <laughs> good I would hope not Godwin my man I don't think there's anyone upstairs It's a bit weird, but that there are still bodies lying here. It's like it was so long time ago we've been in here. killed all those abominations. I'm sure you need supplies after that. He might be at the lake. On my way. Yeah, finally. Nothing special. Hmm. Okay, let me take a break here, and now uh, I'm going to check where the guy is so we don't lose time. So, uh, yeah, I can finish the quest, go to party camp, get my weapon done, and uh, return to Orzammar to follow with the main story. Alright, guys, thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one.